Hey, Chris Martin here. Uh, today I'm going to show you basically step-by-step uh, step on what to do if you've got a hard drive that you need things backed up with. And so here I've got one that I've been currently using. Uh, this is a Seagate. There's Western Digital. There's Lacey. Um, all sorts of different types of discs that you can get. You can get them online. You can get them from Walmart, Costco, Sam's Club, um, and whatnot. So with these, uh, you take the USB, basically, if you get this from the store, you're going to plug this in directly into the USB. All right. And on screen, you should see uh, a lot of times, if, if it's brand new, it should pop up with, a, do you want to use this as a time machine backup? And if you do, it will initialize the disk, and you basically just walk through it, and then you're able to choose that. Up on the screen here, I've got... Uh, Time Machine Preferences. Once it initializes or formats the drive, um, basically I want to select that as the disk. And um, I've got uh, this one almost pretty full. In the options though, I had some people ask me, well what if I want just certain thing to be um, saved and nothing else? Well that's a good, that's a good question. Exclude these items from backups, and uh, I can add different folders or regions of my drive. So if I click on uh, Applications, I can exclude the whole Applications folder. Um, this might be a little more tedious. Uh, I can uh, it doesn't exclude everything that's cached locally to my iCloud, uh, iCloud documents, desktop. Exclude, go in, documents. Let's say I wanted just my pictures folder backed up. And one thing is that uh, if you're not using a backup, you're playing with fire, you're, you're destined for failure eventually. Um, everything works up until it doesn't. And so. A lot of people uh, forget about their downloads folder, that there's a lot of files still in their downloads folder. Music folder. I've pretty much chosen everything in there. And, uh, I wanted to make sure, go to my finder up here, preferences, uh, sidebar. The last thing I had, uh, had not checked was that. So. Save that. So basically, everything that's in my, my pictures folder, and if my iPhoto library was in my pictures folder, which it should be, then that's what's going to be uh, saved. So um, if I wanted to add that, you know, you could, but that's the actual folder that I want. So basically, what I'm saying is that I don't want anything to be backed up except for my pictures folder. So I'm excluding all of these folders from my backup. Uh, I hit save. And then I can go through and back up now. So one suggestion I have is that if you have a backup drive, there's no need to carry it with you from place to place. That's just more susceptibility to failure on the drives part. So what I would do is um, I would leave it in one spot, whether home or work. And when you get there, plug it in, and it should, uh, should work just fine. So uh, that's it for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.